Hi guys and girls and welcome to Dr. Dave's Tech Solutions. Today we are going to show you how to reset your Windows 10 if it is not performing very well. So to get started we're going to head over to the start button, head over to the cog which is your settings, you're going to head to update and security. You're going to always want to make a backup just in case the restart doesn't go very well and you lose your files etc. So make a backup first before you carry on then head over to the recovery option. The top one here allows you to refresh Windows so because Windows is already pre-installed on your machine it allows you to reset Windows back to default settings. Then you've got the advanced option down here, so if your Windows 10 isn't running right and you've got a copy of Windows 10 on disk, chuck it in the drive and you can normally repair your Windows from there. But the safest option, because I haven't got a copy of Windows 10, is to go for the reset this PC. So get started. These are the two options. Keep my files, remove apps and settings and keep my personal files, or remove everything. Remove all your personal files and apps and settings. When I'm working on a friend's or customer's computer, I always keep their personal files. So I'd always choose keep my files option. If you want and you're selling the computer to somebody else and you don't want them getting hold of any of your files, always remove everything. Like I said, this is a way for you to reboot your Windows if it's not working properly and it will get you back on track so you'll be able to keep all of your files but anything that you've installed any games any softwares etc will be removed either way but your photos downloads etc will be kept if you choose keep my files so that is the easiest option to refresh your windows 10 and get it back to working how it was when you first got your pc and that is all you need to know guys and girls so thanks for watching dr dave and we'll catch you on the next video